Well, Joseph, uh, a lot of the damage here has been roofs, uh, power lines, things like that. They've kind of started to section this off for us. We're here with Oklahoma City Fire Department, Scott Douglas, uh, just to kind of get an update on what's going on, what you guys have been seeing here. Just kind of walk me through it. Sure. I mean, as, as everyone is aware now, we did have a tornado strike here around 1.30 this morning. Um, our initial response was, was pretty difficult just due to the torrential downpour. Um, so trying to search through this area when the, the rain was hitting us really hard was, was pretty difficult. But uh, we ended up having five people that were injured and being transported to local hospitals due to, uh, thankfully, these were non-life-threatening injuries. And fortunately, uh, we've yet to have any fatalities reported. So, uh, you know, we just did our best to sweep through the area to make sure that anybody was trapped, needed rescued. And uh, once that happened, uh, we kind of reconned our efforts. And now we're, we're joining up with the police department now to, to basically do a damage assessment throughout the area. And whose kind of responsibility is that? What does that look like? Uh, so we just got through with a meeting with emergency management. Uh, the, the police department will be they'll be the main the main people behind the damage assessment so as soon as that information comes available we'll make sure you get that was there ever any search and rescue needed here um, in this area yeah we searched through the entire area uh, we did have some minor injuries there was some walking wounded people that were going to seek treatment on their own and then east of here uh, closer to triple x road we did have an overturned mobile home uh, we rescued two people from a from a mobile home that was overturned. They actually had an air conditioning that landed on them, so uh, they were in need of our help, and we extricated them from their mobile home. I mean, how tough does it make it when you're in the middle of a storm trying to help these people? Uh, the conditions is what made it extremely tough. You know, it's, it's tough to respond to an area that's been devastated by a natural disaster such as a tornado. Um, just debris piles everywhere. You're not sure. You're trying to orient, your, orient yourself in the neighborhood, so it's tough to add that with the torrential down, downpours that we had. So uh, we did what we could. We swept through the area as, as fast as possible and addressed the needs that we needed to. And then I think my last question is, is there anywhere that people are going to be reunited, that kind of thing? Um, I haven't heard, I haven't spoke with PD yet on, on, on that just yet. I'm not sure. Okay. Thank you so much. You bet. We'll see you guys right back after this break.